come to the question number six that is also related to your stocks and share good question you can say good question because this type of tricky question generally cat or this level of example prefer now this question i will just read neva invested rupees 32400 in 8% stock at 90 okay she sold out rupees 18000 stock value of 18000 stock when the price rose to 95 and remaining a stock at 98 again after selling after selling both of uh, the, bo uh, both at different prices means 18000 at 95 and remaining at 98 she invested the total sale total money whatever she got in 10% stock at 96.5 find the change in income of neva what is happening here initially you will see then you will first neva here are steps you just look neva is invested money in 8% stock 8% of 90 further she sold in two way one is 18000 remaining will be amount one is 95 one is 98 after selling whatever amount she got a1 she has invested in 10% of 96.5 this is full story now question is telling find the change in income of the neva means what is the change in income if earlier she has done this transaction means this is purchase and this is sold from here she has got some income that is income 1 and from here also might be she got some income income 2 question is told, telling not to calculate only i1 and i2 question is telling change in income means what will be the value of i2 minus i that what to find if you will see question it is lengthy this all calculation you have to do no alternative then we can put some common sense some some shortcut some tricky some cheat code to solve this type of question like simple thing will look here one initial share was 8% finally she is purchasing 10% means what is change here 8 to 10 how much how much percentage change on the average 2% change what is total amount 32400 2% of you can say around 325 means uh, 20 we have removed that will be out due to percentage means 2 percentage of otherwise you write if you are 2 percentage of 3020 4000 if you want you can write like this exactly okay effectively 2 percent of 32400 what will be 2 percent here if you are not doing any value addition between these two transaction then 2% of 3 32400 will be around around 700 approximately approximately 700 or actually you can say it is 648 2% then answer will be little more than 600 or around 700 little more than 700 or around 700 it cannot be go, it cannot go more than that because if you are not adding any value also then minimum you will get around 648 here you are adding some value due to selling reselling purchasing repurchasing you are doing four number of transaction due to that transaction some value addition would be there means this 2 percentage of base amount 32400 would be 2 percentage of some other amount maybe 38000 amount or maybe 40000 or maybe 45000 this amount effective amount would be changed but this percentage will be almost same Here eight percent, here ten percent. Means two percent out of thirty-two thousand four hundred will be around seven hundred. Any option choice is there around seven hundred? Only choice B is given. You can mark blindly because mathematically it is justified. Confusion would be there if one choice has given seven hundred ten, another has given another option has given seven hundred thirty-five. Then very difficult. Then very difficult to pick which one will be there. Then you have to calculate. But around seven hundred or six hundred, only one option is given. Another option, all are higher side. This is again four digit number, four digit number. This is very less. Then this two minutes effort, whatever you will get to solve. Just you look how much lengthy. You will able to mark seven hundred. Mark the B. Mark the B. But if you want to understanding point of view, just will try to understand what is happening here. Amount of a stock invested thirty two thousand four hundred. C has purchased at ninety percent. These all are, I think, you are able to understand. Thirty-two thousand four hundred of nine hundred ninety uh, rupees into hundred. Amount actual amount will be thirty-six thousand. Means market value was ninety rupees, but value wise amount of a stock was thirty-six thousand. Number of shares amount invested by ninety three sixty. Dividend or income three sixteen to eight because share is eight percent of ninety. 
series 8% of 90. Then total dividend you see will get 2880. Now means total uh, amount value valuation is 36,000 and total number of share is 360 and dividends is getting 2880. Now second process will come second step means she is selling now. Amount received by 18,000 at 95. She is selling the 18,000 18, at the rate of 95 and remaining at the rate of 98. By chance total amount is 36k then this side also will come 18k. 18k at 95, 18k at 98. 18k at 95, 18k into 95 by 100, 17,100. Amount received by 18,000 at 98, 17,640 just by selling just by selling half of the amount she has sold at the rate of 95 share 95 rupees share and half of the amount she has sold at the rate of 98 total amount she got 34,740 now what she is doing the same amount she is investing in 10 percent of 10 percent of 96.5 means 34,740 divided by 96.5 it is written in fraction term no, same is 96 into half 193 by 2 it will get 360 shares now dividend is 10 rupees per share in this share then it will come 3600 means total income has become 3600 earlier income was 2880 now income is 3600 how much you got 720 the same thing I have done in shortcut in very sparkling way 2% out of base. Base was 32,400, 2% of 32,400 will be 648. Exactly, it will not 648 because 32,400 valuation will go up due to these four transactions. Maybe it will go around 35 to 36,000. It has gone to 36,000. Due to 2% of 36,000, it will become 720. Easy? Understanding easy, but so 